those of you that follow my channel and see me quadding down this trail, this is what it's like in the winter time. Drive your truck. You gotta call your kilometers up and down. She's got some fresh snow on it. We had a little skip last night. I'm, uh, I'm towing tires for my trail because this is a uh, another company is uh, doing some pulling out some stuff here. So they got this road done up pretty good this winter. Usually ours is a little less. It's like a gold trail. It comes a truck. So. try to get back and chop some up but this road's too busy right now. Okay, I just figured I'd show you some of the road here in the winter. Just gonna groom the yards. She's winter here. I just hauled over a couple loads of wood. Split it up there by my truck. Sometimes I throw it right in the truck and deliver it. The sawmill, they'll easily use it till spring. Whew, she's chilly. Minus 24, not too bad. <laughs> she's a cold day. Oh. The wolves have been back. They were around a couple of my traps here, but I don't see nothing going on there. I got to check when I get back. I'm all steamed up. And uh, looks like we got the third Wolverine out of this box. It looks pretty long. Oh. Holy. Look at the patch. Big guy. He's laid right out there. Ooh, another bright one. Holy. Look at that light one. That is a big guy. Holy. Maybe that was what was over 
I can't already tell there, but I'm pretty sure the wolves were there. He's a big guy, it's sure. He got that chain all spun up. Nice and sunny, but it's cold. Come on. That's a Jim Dandy. Holy crap, that's probably the lightest one I ever got. That's a big Wolverine, man. It's probably full of meat. Well, oh, that's a big Wolverine. That's a crazy color. Whew. That's a beauty. I got white, white on his paws. Beauty. That Wolverine was all around. He got into that Martin box the other day, so I put a 330 there, but he wouldn't go in him, but I don't know if it's the one I caught. ran over that wolf trap back there too, but he didn't step on it. And I had a 330 up there where I caught the lynx and the fisher. And I had lynx in and he eat it. Or Wolverine did. When it's 30 below, they're the, <laughs> they're the animals that's on the move. Okay, I gotta go back and see what the wolves are doing. I think Wolverine was fooling around here quite a bit, but I see wolf tracks over at the other bait, so I'm gonna get over there. I wasn't gonna stay out tonight, but I think I might because I gotta fix stuff up. through there but I haven't walked at all I'll walk it tomorrow when I set more snares but they've been all around here they're at a couple of my uh, peoples but they're not pissing on it they're going by it I don't know if it's something up with that piss or not never had them reject it so I'm gonna continue on here, go check the other boxes I got over there and head her back to camp. Gonna have a lot of stuff to do tomorrow because I can't let them eat this moose and not catch the other one. Crazy, they got a lot gone there now. Ravens too. They were here this morning, fresh tracks here, a couple anyway. But there was a herd of them here. She's done a lot of running around over on that trail over there. The 
the last two snares I had out for lynx coming up. I haven't seen a lynx track in about four checks. Minus 34. She's cold. Wolves giving me to run around, making new trails, running down the side of my skidoo trail even. Pretty smart. Pretty smart they are. I just gotta keep trying new stuff. There's only a couple there, not the main bunch, so if the main bunch comes and might have a chance at them. Ooh. Okay, I got two more boxes to check. She's chilly. It's supposed to go down to 32 tonight. That's why I wasn't going to stay out here, but I got no other choice now. I got to fix up stuff. I just found another trap set off too. It's starting to uh, annoy me. Oh, this guy's a big guy. He's a big guy. He's probably full of full of meat though maybe. I don't know. Nice evening. Oh, he's a big wolverine. Big and blonde. Take care of his toes here. Bring him inside and thaw him out to get the trap off him. Oh. Go in and make supper. Hide away for the night. Whew. Cold. It's a cold morning out there. Hopefully my sled will start. Oh, squirrels out though. See them too much when it's really cold. Probably living under the camp here. Have breakfast and then go try to get some more stuff out for the wolves. Cold weather out there, so I was just doing some cats. And I didn't do any video on the other day after I uh, caught this wolverine. I just skinned him. He's a beauty. Gonna keep him. He's got a couple white toes. He's got a Excellent patch, yellowish, but he's a, he's a beauty. 32 pound, he's in good shape. Never had a bit of fat on him, like, not like fat fat. He got fat underneath his, his uh, saddle and stuff, but 
not like they usually do. Yeah, he's a he's a beauty. I took measurements so I could order a mount if I get them. If I try doing them myself, he'd make a great rug too. He's great either way. He's a beauty. So I figure I'd video that what he looked like before I finish him up here. I'm gonna gonna do the paws here now after supper and uh, try to do as much as I can with him. My flesh and beams out to camp, so I'll get the get as much done to him as I can bad belly that one right there but these other two are this one i couldn't even see the spots but i can see them there now they show up more here on this phone so i'm picking at them i got four more taken out there i don't know me i got done now i put six in a box for a guy so there's four eight there's 12 there that's the Wolverine I did out to camp. And a Fisher, there's some Martin. The last Martin I got in a 330 right there. You should be dried out, should take you off. I was a little off on my calculation. The only tree that could have hung it up. That's the one he landed in, a green one too. I saw it in a bit more there, but I wouldn't I didn't want to get underneath and I bucked them up like that four four feet at a time. And he wouldn't come out of that tree. So then I went to follow this one. And this one didn't go where I wanted. <laughs> They're curved on top, so I missed about 14 feet. <laughs> nice wood though. Nice pine. This one's a bit smaller, but still good wood. There's quite a few of them here. Some are good, some not so good. This one here was a bit red. I'll burn that in the shop though if it's too punky. This, I don't mind if it's solid, but... That's a nice dead one back there. Right there. I can tell he's a good one. <laughs> Looks like a spruce actually. It's only about, uh, mine's 19 or 20. 